For this circuit, please find the voltage across and the charge stored in each capacitor. These three segments, they are in parallel with each other, so they all have the same voltage. They all have the same 10 volts. So this segment has 10 volts. This segment gets 10 volts as well. So right away, we know the 8 nanofarad gets 10 volts. And to find the charge, we just have to do Q equals to CV. The capacitance is 8 nano. The voltage is 10 volts. So the charge is 80 nanocoulombs. The 5 and 20 are in series. So they have to share the 10 volts. It may not be obvious how many volts each of them gets, so I will find their equivalent capacitance first. For these two in series, we can use the 1 over equation to find the equivalent capacitance. 1 over 5 plus 1 over 20, which equals to 4 plus 1 divided by 20, which is 1 fourth. That means we flip these two over, the equivalent capacitance is 4 nanofarad. Capacitors in series have the same charge, so it can be convenient for us to find the charge first. The Q equivalent is C times V. It's the C equivalent times the voltage they get. That's 4 nano times the voltage they get is 10 volts. So the Q equivalent is 40 nanocoulombs, and uh, because they get the same charge, this is the charge on the 5 nanofarad. It is also the charge on the 20 nanofarad. So now we know the charge here is 40, 40. And we can use the charge to find the voltage because the voltage is Q over C. So Voltage for this one is the charge 40 nano divided by the capacitance 5 nano. That's uh, 8 volts. And this one is uh, 40 nano divided by 20 nano, and that's uh, 2 volts. To check our work, we can use the fact that these two capacitors together, they share 10 volts. 8 plus 2, yes, it is 10 volts. Of course, we can also find the voltage first and then find the charge. To find the voltage first, we can use uh, proportion, for example. For these two in series, uh, they get the same charge, and Q equals to CV. If they have the same charge, that means that the one with a larger capacitance gets uh, less voltage. And in this particular case, they are exactly inversely proportional to each other. So if the capacitance is 1 to 4, that means uh, they'd be sharing the voltage 4 to 1. See, the voltage is 4 to 1. 